case filed against Mashrafe. This time it is not anything related to politics. It is all related to cricket and it is all authentic. Sarwar Chowdhury, who was one of the main owners during Silhet Striker's first appearance in BPL has filed a case against Mashrafe and other owners of the team. I have confirmed from Mr. Sarwar, and these are the following allegations. I, Mashrafe bought shares of the franchise worth 4 crore and 50 lakhs BDD forcefully. He didn't pay the full amount. 2. He ran the franchise like a dictator. 3. He gave DA asterisk TH threats to the owner. If you followed Silhet Strikers in their first edition, you all would have noticed Mr. Sarwar was the main face of the franchise when it comes to ownership. He is an honest and passionate man who deeply cares for Bangladesh cricket. But during Silhet's second season, he got vanished from everywhere despite all other owners of the team, including Mashrafe, was present. Do you understand why now? I followed all these situations closely. Mr. Sarwar was so depressed that he disappeared from everywhere, including deactivating his Facebook account for months. Now here is my story. Just after the end of Silhet Striker's first season in BPL, Sarwar by knocked me and said he is not happy with the current media team's performance and asked me if I'm willing to work for Silhet. He gave me the opportunity to become the head of media and make my own team for second season. It was a massive moment for me because Silhet is my hometown and I love Silhet. Everyone who knows me knows about my passion for cricket, so it was another dream project for me. Without any hesitation, I said yes and I was looking forward to work for Silhet Strikers and upcoming BPL. Sarwarbai said he will finalize the deal in two weeks. But after one month, there was no update. So I asked him about the progress and this is what he replied, I am sorry, I would not be able to take you. The current media team is run by Mash's friends agency and I'm unable to remove him and Mash will never let me do it. Imagine how worse and helpless a situation can be when the team owner is saying sorry to you because he can't take me in his own team because of a player. His hands are tied. This is how syndicate runs in Bangladesh. This is how deserved people do not get opportunity to work. And this is how people who we idolize so much are the main boss of such syndicate. I felt shattered to see this dream project go away from me. This is one of the few reasons why I left Bangladesh. Because I am disgusted with this syndicate situation and it didn't happen with only Silhet. Other teams are parts of this syndicate too, and just like many, I was a victim. I hope Sarwarbai gets the justice.